Hi there, and welcome to yet another episode in Sound Paint. In today, we're going to look at our xylophone ensemble. You may know that we have all these acoustic grand ensembles in all different configurations. This is sort of the idea of taking orchestral instruments that are typically not in ensembles and then make them into ensembles. So what is it about the violin and the French horn and the flutes that always makes us like, oh, they can be in groups. But when it comes to instruments like marimbas or pianos or harps or xylophones or glockenspiels, they don't come in ensembles. So years ago, I got the idea of getting a full symphonic hall and then started creating unique ensembles for orchestral instruments that are not typically in ensembles. And that became our acoustic grand ensembles. In the video today, we're gonna to explore our xylophone ensemble. It's one of my favorite ensembles in the library, maybe together with the glockenspiel ensemble. All these ensembles, we did 10 different ones, are all available in Soundpaint, by the way. But the xylophone ensemble was unique in the sense that if you think of a xylophone, it's sort of this, dare I say, like childlike instrument in its normal configuration. The same thing with the glockenspiel as well, that it has sort of a little cute, like pingy kind of sound. And Granted, in the orchestra, it sits in a unique frequency spectrum, so you can use one xylophone and it will still be audible over the orchestra because it has that sort of very defined attack, if you will. But what happens when you get five of them? Well, it depends on what kind of melody you use, and that was something we figured out as well. So for that reason, we recorded the ensemble both with soft and hard mallets. So there's a felt kind of sound for the soft ones, and then there's a more sort of pristine wooden kind of mallet that gives a more like piercing attack, the one you would typically hear in the orchestra, that sort of pingy kind of sound. But as you're about to see and witness, there's a lot of magic in the air when you have five xylophones side by side in an orchestral hall. The magic is truly unlike anything else. Now, I could try to demonstrate that, but I think it's so much more fun to have Nick Simrad do it. So Nick is going to take over and uh, take this xylophone ensemble for a wicked spin. So welcome. Thank you. 